Auto Trail Frontier Serrano. This is an eight meter long, four berth, two belt firecracker. Not like the Serrano chili peppers because they're nice and tiny, uh, but it's still quite hot. Welcome to WeBuyAnyMotorCaravan.com. My name's Pete, let's take you around this one. Coming in at just over eight meters in length and three meters in height, this is a big motorhome. It weighs in at four and a half tons as well, so you do have to check your license, make sure you've got that Cat C1 on there. If you're old like me, then you would have had that straight away. If you're a little bit younger, like no one in our team, you still have to check it and make sure that you've got that license on there. It is just a beautiful motorhome. You've got that lovely awning at the top. And if when you come round to the back, you have actually got a bike rack, but I'll show you where that is shortly. Reversing camera at the top and you know it's the new design auto trail because it's got the 50p style spare wheel uh, cover there. The old style used to be the 10p's, this is now a, now a 50p design. Said it had a bike rack, didn't I? Here it is. So you've got a two bike bike rack actually in the garage. Your awning pole as well and you've got a little door here that means you can get from the actual uh, main habitation area into the garage so you can pick out something. Uh, from your garage boot that you may need. A couple of LED lights as well. Really makes this quite a nice, I reckon you could sleep in here, you know. It'd fit a mattress, you could sleep in here, couldn't you, Liam? Definitely. Yeah, I thought so. Let me show you the rest. So when you come down the side of the van, you've got your Truma heater, outdoor shower point, always useful if the kids get a bit muddy. A small little cupboard there, but the one bit that you're really gonna like is you've got a lovely big wet locker under here. You've got two leisure batteries. So it really does make this a multifunctional motorhome with it. When you come around to the front, you've got the beautiful color on the cab, the LED running lights. You've even got a couple of lights at the top there that make it look a little bit like a Pokemon Dragon, I think, something like that. But it comes back to the fiery chili, doesn't it? Let me take you inside. When you get inside this motorhome, it's powered by the 2.3 litre 150 brake Fiat Ducato engine. Uh, but you really don't notice that it's on the 150 because it really does uh, move, especially for an eight metre long motorhome. You've got the sat nav up here, six speed manual, USB connectors. Got a telly here. It even works, which is nice. I don't know how you'd see it sat in these seats i'm not going to lie to you it's going to be a bit of a neck acre or you'd have to be looking through the mirror next to liam uh, my cameraman say hello liam hello there we go all done see sound happy um but it's a lovely place to be i think because of the length of the motorhome and the width of the motorhome it really does give that space that you need you've got your double sofas here in the in the lounge area these fall out into being a, uh, a double bed, obviously. Your little dinette table. I want my dinner. This is for your kids. This is where it is. There is a bit of a downside about this motorhome. It's only two belts, but four berth, which means that someone's gonna have to drive a car to meet you if they want to sleep in the motorhome with you on site. Probably isn't a bad thing because then you've got a car to go around and do all your sort of sightseeing and all of that. Uh, it is a bad thing though if you want to take your kids with you. So this is a child free motorhome. It does come with carpets as well, even though we've got them out at the moment. Let me take you back through the van. Touch screen controls, your Truma heating. Then when you look down through the cab, there's the mirror I was talking about. We've got an auto trail brolly in the door. Look at that. When the great British weather gets you. In the kitchen area, you've got your microwave and a really big work surface. Obviously, you've got your four ring gas burner there and the oven. Look at that for a work surface. We've even got a sink. We always need a sink. Someone needs to do the washing up and look how many plugs. Wonderful. Look at the size of the fridge freezer on that one. It is absolutely huge. Separate shower here and here's your bathroom. Ebo, just this side here for you. Separate toilet. Nasty sink. Not gonna lie, 
you will have to sit side saddle the door does shut on you a little bit for your knees you will have to sit side saddle on that but it's a good good nice size bathroom lovely big shower area for you there even some of the bigger boys will fit in that one the main selling point of this van though is this back bed it is absolutely <sighs> massive look at this this is your selling point this is for any tall people not me obviously you've got a bracket for another tv here like i say this is what you want to be taking away probably better for couples couples with friends that want to meet with the car but uh, yeah i like this motor home a lot i do like this motor home a lot how much was this new 68 that's 68 pounds new wow not bad the serrano not just a fiery chili pepper not just an italian surname not just a silly song serrano oh. it's also one hell of a motorhome great british weather sometimes can't be kind to us we like to be kind to you though don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let's face it every now and then we need to sing in the rain serrano oh hey you made it to the end of the video please press subscribe at the bottom or like if you're on our facebook and watch the latest news and motorhome reviews to find out more information you can go on our website www.webuyanymotorcaravan.com telephone us on 01283 240 237